Welcome to the Eat Audio. Release your wolf. Hello? What do you have, Thomas? No, love, shh, shh, just stay there, okay? Are you sure? Thomas, Thomas, you verified it. Of course, I trust you, I just want to make sure. All right, got it. When was he last seen? I know, Neil would only show himself for a reason. But even if it's a trap, I need to check it out. Maybe I could, I don't know, reason with him. He has to know that this is wrong. I mean, the guy who trained me would. I'll be careful. Thanks, Thomas. Don't give me that look. That look, the sad, kicked puppy dog look. Maybe that works on some people, but not on me. I'm a highly trained bodyguard, love. If Neil does try to stage a trap, he's going to have a hell of a time capturing me. I won't go down easily, and he knows that. Bastard probably just wants to talk or something. He always did love to gloat. No. I want you to stay put, preferably in this bed. Do not move. Not one inch. I'm serious. I know you. I know you'll be tempted to do something stupid, but for once, please, just stay put. Promise me. Promise me. All right, good. I'll be back. Your father's security team has been briefed. They may not be as good as me, but they'll do. Hey, hey, it's going to be okay. I'm going to end this. When I get back, maybe we can watch that movie you like. Yeah, that's the one. All right. Mm Mmm. Mm. It'll be fine, you'll see. Hey, hey, look at me. I promise you, I'm gonna end this. It's going to be okay. I love you too. Please, please, love, don't worry, I can handle this. If I couldn't, I would ask for help. I'll be back. Well, I guess you really are as stupid as I thought. Didn't he teach you never to pick up an unknown number before? Oh, don't bother hanging up. I figured you and I could just settle this amicably. No need to get any others involved. Besides, he's already left, right? You wouldn't want anything bad to happen to him, would you? <laughs> Oh, yeah, I don't doubt his combat skills, but a sniper rifle still can trump that, especially when you have one like mine on the payroll. The place he's coming, it's out in the open. My sniper will have a clear shot, just waiting on my word. Of course, we don't have to go down that road. After all, you're somewhat of a master escape artist, aren't you? I'm texting you an address. Be there in 20 minutes. If you don't, he's dead. You tell anybody about this, he's dead. You try to do anything stupid. Well, you get the point, don't you? (laughs) Sorry, sorry. It's really quite unprofessional of me, isn't it? I just can't believe how easy this is. I mean, I knew love made people do stupid things, but this is on a whole new level. For what it's worth, yeah, I promise. You come, he walks free. I'm a man of my word. Once I agree to something, I don't stop until my end of the deal is fulfilled. 
Once you step through these doors, he'll be safe. All right. Twenty minutes and counting. All right, Neil. Enough of the games. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Neil. Shit! Shit! Okay, five people, maybe six. Fuck! Look, I don't suppose we could call it a draw. Guess not. Oh, fuck, I gotta get out of here. One down. All right, two by the door. Come on, focus. This was a setup. Fuck. Which means if I'm here, then... <gasps> no! No, 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 no! Come on, pick up, pick up, love. Looking for someone? Shit. Well, hello to you, too. How do you have this phone, Neil? You can work that one out for yourself, right? I mean, I'd let you talk to them, but they're a bit... <laughs> tied up at the moment. You see what I did there? I've been saving that one for a while. Let me talk to... You're in no place to negotiate. In fact, if you keep making me mad, I might just have to break another rib. You fell in love with an idiot. You know that. Poor fool came running over here as soon as I threatened your life. Neil, this isn't you. We can work this out. Tell me where you are and I'll meet you. We'll talk, just like old times. Do you think I'm an idiot? It's over. You put up a good fight, but in the end, love made you sloppy. I mean, come on. How did you not realize it was a trap? They're innocent, Neil. No one is really innocent. Not your precious client, not you, and definitely not me. Face it, friend. You lost. Best of luck next time. I suppose you heard that, huh? It seems your bodyguard is quite displeased. But hey, I set a trap and it worked out. Well, for everyone except you. Look, about this whole thing, it's really not personal. Well, okay, breaking one of your ribs was personal, but not towards you, towards your bodyguard. Self-righteous bastard thinks the only way is their way. But we've all got to eat, right? Got to have money to live. You understand, right? Ugh. If you can still say rude things like that, I must not have welcomed you properly. The client only said I had to turn you over alive. No rules about what I can do to you until then. You want to have some fun? They all say that. You just wait because so-and-so will come and save me. <laughs> Truth is, if your bodyguard comes anywhere near this compound, I'll know. And I'll put them down. Your bodyguard is good, yeah, but I'm better. And I'm afraid you're going to need more than the power of true love to save the day. But really, don't look so blue. Your part in this play is almost over. Now why don't you get some rest? We've got a big night tonight. No, I tried that, damn it. C can you give me something else? A location, hell, I'll even take an educated guess at this point. Neil has the phone, so track it! Of course it's disabled. Shit! I don't know what to do. Neil is one of the best, and he will complete his job. Fuck! She must be so scared right now, and in pain. This is all my fault. 
I know, I know, you're right. I don't have time for a pity party. I need backup. Anyone, I'll pay. I don't care how much. I know it'll be hard to find people willing to go up against Neil, but there must be someone, anyone. Her? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. She's really the only one available. Mm, shit. Yeah, okay, fine, I'll do it. Wire the money, I'll text the address. I need her ASAP. Thanks. Hey, love. I, I know you, you won't even hear this, but I'm, I'm sitting here going crazy and I just needed, I needed to tell you how sorry I am for dragging you into this mess because, because of me or God knows where with Neil. Probably scared and hurt. Shit. I never should have allowed myself to fall in love with you because this is what happens. People get hurt around me. People die around me somehow and I'm the only one left standing. And if I lose you, well, I'm coming to get you. I hope you know that. You'd be proud. I'm, I'm actually going in with a solid plan, working together with a rival to boot. You'd be proud of me. Look, I keep thinking about when you wanted to watch a movie with me, and I, I should have I should have said yes. I was just so wrapped up with Neil that I didn't take time with you. Time that I could have... Shouldn't worry. I'm coming. I'm coming. You're going to get out of this alive, I swear to you. No matter what happens to me, you're going to be okay. So just hang on, okay? I love you. <laughs> 